Well, despite the chilly temperatures today, summer is almost here. Time to shop for SPF, a beach chair, maybe even a new ride. Car dealerships have a lot of options for financing. So which one is right for you? Joining me now to talk about it is Fred Kreutzer with Kreutzer Financial. Good morning. Good morning. This is a hard one because I feel like whenever it's time to get a car, there are so many questions. So if we want to shop for a new car, is now a good time to go get one? Actually, it is because they're actually already bringing out the 2017 models. Whew, early. I know. I was <laughs> shocked. But we just bought a car and we just realized the 2017s are coming in. So they're actually giving you price breaks on the 2016 models. This is the time. And with Memorial Day weekend, they're going to have a lot of specials. In fact, the specials are actually already going on. They just have an advertisement to Memorial Day weekend. Ah, but very the deals sneaky. are there to be made right now. <laughs> All right. So when it comes to financing, getting loans, there's so many options. There's a lot of options. The average price of a car today, you're looking at $33,000. So if you put $5,000 down, over a five year period of time, you would have paid $3,400 of interest. But we all want these really nice fancy cars with all the electronics. Oh yeah. So having that, people are now stretching car loans over eight years, but understand you might have lowered your car payment to two more, uh, $200 a month, but what you've done is you paid an extra $2,000 of interest. Paying it on the back end. And at the end of eight years, let's face it, you're gonna need a new car, so there's no break after you sold your car. There's no break. I feel like there's always that conflict. Do I buy? Do I lease? What about leasing? Leasing is definitely an individual situation. If you're somebody who's turning over your car and you like that new car every three years, leasing is the way to go. <laughs> yeah. But if you want to own a car, have some equity in a car, because really after five years, the equity on a car really starts to drop. Yeah. But leasing is good for that person that's always looking for that new car every three years. But one thing you got to understand, you'll always have a car payment when you lease. Car payments, oh, if only we could just dust them under the rug, right? Not that easy. Got to do our research. Yes, and affordability is really important. And on cruiserfinancial.com, I do have an affordability nice. to look at what is affordable because it's got to fit within your budget. And when you're talking about interest payments, it all goes back to credit. If you have good credit ratings, you can negotiate and get a better interest on your car loan. So, so real important to keep your credit. Take care of your financials. Yes, right. absolutely. <laughs>